Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do an update for the Drop 10 Before Summer project pan that is created by Amanda and Jessica and Jana. They created this in the beginning of the Fantastic Lady Soul hike. Four years ago now? Is it really four years? Five years maybe? I don't know. A long time. Four years. We were supposed to pick 10 items that reminded us of summer that were beauty related so makeup all skincare, beauty items in general. I did semi good. <laughs> not amazing, but not amazing either. Yeah. I did okay. The first product I have is my Nux dry oil, body oil, whatever you want to call it. And when I put this in, I was pregnant. <laughs> that is no surprise there, but I haven't published it to the world, so I couldn't say that I only used this on my belly for the oil part, you know, you put oil on your belly. Um, but I do. I use this every single night. I have been slacking a little bit for the past week because I have been so tired. But I need to get into the habit again because this needs to go by the finale. And this just needs to go in general because it's so old. <laughs> it's so old. It's almost embarrassing. But yes, this is my progress right here. For a month I think it's okay. I have a long way to go. But yes, I only use this on my belly because I have some lotions that I'm working on in another product for the rest of my body. Um, let's just take this out of the way actually. I have two sheet masks. I haven't used them obviously. They're still here. Maybe I should use one tonight. Hmm. Maybe I should. This is the Body Shop Carrot Cream. I don't love it but I don't hate it. I, it's okay. It's fine. It just moisturized my skin, but I don't like the smell of it. But yes, <laughs> the progress is okay. I could have done better. I have no excuse. I am trying to use this every single morning. I don't think there's SPF in it. I think we clarified that last time. But I use something heavier in the nighttime, so this is just in the daytime until I finish that up. Yeah, I like it because it's lighter. It's not heavy or anything, so it can go underneath my makeup and not cake up everything. My NYX Lingerie Lid item. I have used this a couple of times, so you can't see any progress. Yeah, you can't see any progress because I have only used it a few times, but it is in gold standard. I am wearing this today. I just need to touch up, I think. This is the NYX Butter Gloss in Peaches and Cream. I have used this so much and I actually try to touch up with it every single day. Um, you can't see any progress yet, but I do know these are see-through when you get some use out of them. So that is going to be exciting if I can create a window in this project. That would be amazing. I have the Trended Up Metallica Gel Eyeliner in 50. It's just a metallic... No, it's not really. It's just a covery bronze eyeliner. I have used it like once, maybe. This is the color. Um, yeah, I will show you the measurement. Not a line, but the measurement in a minute. Then we have the Stroke of Genius from W7 in dark brown. This is a brow pencil. I have used it a couple of times, so I have the tiniest amount of progress. And I mean tiny amount. So that is the eyeliner and that is the progress for the brow pencil. Oh my god, that is not a lot. But uh, yeah, that's a new line. Not that exciting, but you know, you do what you do. This is the CND Solar Oil for Nails and Cuticle. The small one. And my progress is so minimal, it's not even funny. This one, right there. Hmm. And the nail polish I have, it is a red W7 nail polish. And I have some, okay, progress. I was up here in the neck and now I'm down to the edge. And that is pretty exciting because I have not been focusing on it, but I have tried to use it alongside this nail polish in my lip pen clip. The last thing I want to talk to you guys about is my W7 Enchanted palette. And this reminded me of summer because I wore it when I got engaged last summer. Or, or with my boyfriend. But yes, this is what it is looking like. This was from another project, but I've used this shade once, I think, on my lower lash line. I don't think I have used anything else from this. 
I want to hit on pan, but I haven't decided on a shade because I obviously only used it once this month. So, motivated, I don't know if I am, but yeah, I need to do better. I need to do better. Yeah, I'm sorry guys, I'm doing my best here. I'm working on a lot of items and the insane part is that I really want to do the 50 Shades of Pink project pan and yeah, I don't know if I'm doing that anyway. I really want to do it though. Because I have way more than 50 pink products in my collection and beauty stash. Hmm, I don't know if I can do it. I'm, gonna, I'm having a baby in October and I really want to do some insane stuff before I get a baby. I don't know. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the series and you are going to check out the other ladies in this collab. I have the master, li master list and everything down below so you can go check that out and watch some more content from me if you're new here please subscribe if you haven't already liked this video and please stay safe in these cra crazy times and i will see you guys in my next video bye